Hello, today I just want to talk about feeling sad, really. This morning I woke up and I felt, not depressed, but things pressing down on me. And, and the one thing I know that I've learned over the years is, then I must seek God. You know, and I've got a few scriptures and I'm going to start with Psalm 71. And it says, Though you have made me see troubles, many and bitter, you will restore my life again. From the depths of the earth, you will again bring me up. 2 Corinthians 12 verse 10 says, That is why, for Christ's sake, I delight in weakness, in insults, in hardships, in persecutions, in difficulties. For when I am weak, then I am strong. This really means that uh, in our humble situation, we find ourselves before God. God is strong and God can work with us. And if you are fortunate that you are not in this situation today, be thankful that God is with you in the way you are and that you maybe are successful or that you are healthy and you've got no illnesses, or whatever the case may be. Then I read from you from Ecclesiastics 7 verse 3. It says, Frustration is better than laughter because a sad face is good for the heart. And why is it good for the heart? Because it makes us think about our situations. It makes us think about things we can, we can change. We, we, we see God. We ask God to, to be involved in our lives. And then it is good for our heart because we can start changing them. Jeremiah 15 verse 19, it says, And if you repent, I will restore you that you may serve me. If you utter worthy, not worthless, words, you will be my spokesman. Let the people turn to you, but you must not turn on them. 2 Corinthians, uh, sorry, 2 Chronicles 15 verse 2, it says, uh, The Lord is with you when you are with Him. If you seek Him, He will be found by you. But if you forsake him, he will forsake you. And Isaiah 38 verse 16 says, Lord, by such things people live, and my spirit finds life in them too. You restored me to health. You let me live. Father God, I thank you that I and the listener can come before you today and I just bring my my sadness before you my downcastness and 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 i just want to remind myself and you the listener god is for us he is for us and not against us and when we find ourselves in situations like this press on press into god because you will come out feeling better on the other side. You will be stronger because God has made you stronger. And Father, I just thank you this morning that I can, I can really come to you and I can seek you. Because you say, if you seek me, you will be found. And Father, I want to find you. I desire a deeper relationship with you. I seek you, God. I ask you, Holy Spirit, to renew my mind, to work in my heart. So that my every day, in, irrespective of what I go through, my day is committed to you. I wake up in the morning, I read my scripture, my Bible, your word, your living word. I get to know you, I fellowship with you. Father God, now Holy Spirit, I ask you, as I draw near to you and as I seek you, lift me up. Don't let my, my heart be downcast all the time. Lift me up and as I seek you, that I will be found and that you can fellowship with me because I desire that from you. And Father God, I also ask you that you restore us as you say, that you restore me to health and you let me live in one uh, Isaiah 38 verse 16. Father God, and because you are Jehovah Rapha, God that heals, you are Emmanuel, God with us. I come to you today and I just ask you, God, 
and, and, and I just want to share this with you also, people. This morning I woke up and my foot was sore. My foot is actually still sore. And I just bring my foot before God. And uh, I, I ask God, God, I am your child. I have given you my life. I want to be your spokesman. If you find me worthy, I know that you will do what you said you will do and that it is, is restore me to health. And I address the pain in my foot. Pain in my foot, I address you now in the name of Jesus Christ. I tell you to leave. Leave now instantly. You've got no place in my life. God is victorious. Jesus Christ is my Savior and healer. And I thank you, Father God. Holy Spirit, I thank you that you are guiding me, that you are sharing with me in my, my mind and my heart. And as I pray that in, in the times when I wait upon you, that you are starting to give me answers. And today, because I've been sad, I just come to you and I, and I ask you, God, lift me up. Take me out of the depths of, of Seol, of Hades, and bring me back to your, your land, the restored land. Father God, I thank you and I bless your glorious and holy name. And I pray this in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.